Hey guys, how's your shield canine? I'm here with Jasper. Jasper, the German Shepherd has been brought in to us for some leash reactivity issues towards other dogs. So you're gonna kind of see a little bit about what we do with dogs like this. So I'm gonna demonstrate exactly what a lot of people do. Hey, look, sit, 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 down, hug. And none of that bullshit works. I'm gonna take Jasper through the basics and I'm gonna show you a little bit about how we work these guys. The loose leash walking, and there's a reason I do it. I wanna see dogs just like Jasper, super supple on the leash, super easy on the leash, that reacts to information on the leash, that pays attention to the handler, and that's easy on the leash. So we have that. The next thing, good experiences are really important, guys, because I don't avoid with reactive dogs, other dogs, because I also want the dog to have good experiences. So that we don't just keep the dog in the backyard, we actually get the dog out and about in public, and we make sure the dog understands that he has an obligation to maintain these behaviors, even under the highest levels of distraction. If your training is only good in one place, it's useless. This is what we're gonna do. If you guys just follow behind me and you're gonna see. All I'm gonna work on with him is his leash skills, as I always start with the leash skills. I'm gonna start tapping him with the e-collar for every command on a low level. Good. Sit. 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 Good. Come on. So when he does the right thing, and he believes that if he does the right thing, I'll be there not only to protect him, but I'll hold him accountable, then he's gonna behave himself for the most part. Now 